Okay, oh, so we are going all the way um, over to like this direction. But uh, I also want to say we've got quite a ways to go. It's honestly not as far as I thought it was going to be. I need to like kill that, um, that diving bell spider up there. I kind of want to like shoot it, but like I also worry that I'm going to like lose my arrows. Is he coming down? <laughs> he is terrifying. Is he stuck up there? Oh, I wasn't expecting this. Are you kidding? There's one of my arrows. Oh, there's a second arrow that just fell. <laughs> oh, I'm glad that uh, Trudy 2 wasn't around. That's for sure. Oh, here's the other one. I was expecting that, you know, like once we killed it, it would fall, but yeah, that was just not the case. Okay, all right, back to business. <laughs> way to bullying that poor spider that was stuck. Another way of looking at it is that I put it out of its misery. So, welcome. He's been hanging out there for like a long time. They keep like spawning on top of that grass blade and I, I don't know why. We'll just do a little slurp. Or a big slurp. I didn't know we were gonna take that whole droplet there. Oh, that's a big boy. Oh, let's uh try to avoid you. Excuse me, pardon me. Is he like terrorizing that aphid? Did you see him? He was like, oh, a snap. <laughs> I mean, not that we haven't killed an aphid in our lifetime, but that's beside the point. <sighs> Gotta watch out uh, for mosquitoes over here. There's a bumblebee. I remember I was looking for those the other day. Uh, it's probably for the best that we went to the picnic table because I think I did end up needing to like kill two of them. That might have been kind of difficult to find. Ladybug up there. Hi, ladybug. Ooh, glad we didn't jump there. <laughs> Almost jumped like right in front of the uh, the spiders. And yeah, there's my uh, mosquito friends up here. But I did want like a mosquito beak for um for what you call it um my sword uh, repair. Like even if I don't like use my sword for like much longer. But maybe we should go ahead and, like, kill one of these dudes. Luckily, our crossbow does a lot of damage. Oh, oh come on. We can kill them, like, so much faster now, thank goodness. Oh, okay, alright. Uh, is another one coming after me? It is. We got the mosquito beak though, so oh, I did not mean to. Oh, I didn't like that. <laughs> I accidentally like went into a uh, first-person mode, but then it like looked in the mosquito's body. I didn't like that at all. Go away, shoo! Leave me alone! Oh, oh, we got two. We got two friends. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I'm just going to swim for a little bit. Do 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 do. do. Go back up here. It's Trudy too. Our fishy friend might be around. There we go. Over halfway there. We're getting there. I was say I think I like hear a spider around. Yes, I do. I'm surprised it didn't see me. <laughs> I like that the Franken line has that like one line that we drew on it. <laughs> A masterpiece. <laughs> oh, really need to add on to that at some point. Got a bombardier over here. It's trying to avoid, but obviously that didn't go too well. I need to like head more in this direction. I was about to say, because I might be missing some stuff, like a tooth thing here underwater, is it? 
Mm, not that I'm seeing. But we'll head up here and we'll get our hammer. Sweet. I'm glad that we uh, have gotten enough milk molars to get the maximum mutation slots. We still need uh, a good bit more to unlock anything else. Max health and that kind of thing. There we go. Ooh. Couldn't get back up there for a second. Mila, nice to see you. How's it going? It's going well. Thank you, thank you for asking, friend. How are things going on your side? I hope that you're great. Is this a spider hole up here? I think this is a spider hole. No? Not a sp Okay, well maybe it's a spider hole normally, but there's not a spider in there right now. I'm kind of surprised that there isn't anything else, like a scabby or something. Upper Yard Ascent. So that is where we can explode something. <sighs> but yeah, sadly, I don't have an explodey thing on me. Uh, a a, a brop, brop burst? I'm gonna need a, another ant egg for that. Can you get the ant eggs? Anyone in chat, if you guys know the answer to this question, let me know. Um, does anyone know, can you get ant eggs from the black ant hill? I don't know if I remember seeing any ant eggs in there, but I'm just curious. So it would want you to jump like up here on the roots and go up here. Some rock plants really close by. He's like, is there no way to like jump like over on that rock over there just to kind of like avoid blowing this up? <laughs> or maybe even like on a grass blade or something. You could like build up to it too, but. That wasn't even like quite as far over as I had my uh, marker at. I don't think there's any like direct ways to get up like over here. We'll still like take a look because I haven't like been really on this side of the picnic table. So like might as well. What if we drew Weighty Frog on there? Oh gosh, that would be like so much time of my life wasted that I would never get back. <laughs> Got the train tickets for tomorrow for your trip to the capital. Gonna go to uh, a Japanese wood art exhibition and then some K-beauty and clothing shopping. Oh, Mila, that sounds wonderful. I hope that you have such a great time. Please be safe when you go tomorrow too. I just love riding the train. Um, any opportunity that I get to, ooh, Alan. Um, I think it's just like very like soothing and relaxing in a way just to be able to like sit and not worry about driving and just enjoying the sights around you is, is really quite nice. Can I analyze that pollen? Yeah, we can analyze the pollen. Cool. I'm glad that I like went and grabbed it. When I first saw it, I was like, oh, that's just like nectar or something. I'm not gonna bother. I'm glad that we did. It does seem to be some raw science over here at the very least. Yeah. All right. Well, we didn't come over here for nothing. I'll start working on my acceptance speech. There was indeed something. Um, it is interesting how this will let you get on top of this rock. It's like almost like it's leading you up to somewhere. But yeah, I still don't think you could. Those rocks are just like way too high. All right, um, so we might have to uh, go back for the, the ant armor after all. I should have just like brought it with me. I was wondering if we would be able to find uh, another way up. It does not seem like that is the case. Hey, Biscuit, welcome in. How are you? I hope you're great. Oh man, my uh, aphid rose just spoiled. Gosh darn it, I should have eaten it. 
I forgot about it. Big sad. And it's got like the zoomies right now. He is just like running like back and forth. I was uh, wondering if there was a uh, milk molar in this bottle. And uh, yes, the answer to that is yes. <laughs> so let's go up here and uh, see if we can get to it. Also, I don't know if I've cut these mushrooms before. We haven't. So I think that's another thing that we can analyze. Cool, cool. Okay, awesome. Another chunk. Yeah, it is. Nothing in the cap. Hopefully we can get back out of here. <laughs> From what you read online, it looks like you can you can you can get ant eggs from the black ant hill as well. Interesting, Rochelle. Okay. The only other problem is like, I didn't bring any other ingredients that I would need for, um, for whatchamacallit, um, the explosives, the brat burst. We would need fungal growth, ooh, gum, hello. Interesting place. Um, and I do have the upgraded shovel now, so we can get this, cool. So yeah, I, I need to go back anyway to get like my gas mask so we can get some fungal growth. And, uh, oh, what was the other thing? There is something else too. I, like I'm completely blanking on it. But yeah, either way, thank you for looking at that up for me, Rochelle. That's definitely good to know like for the future. If I need some more and we're like over that way, then I could do that. There was a golden molar underneath the the um the gum. <laughs> that was a good hiding spot. I like didn't even notice that like we were around a, a milk molar um on our scabby scanner. I was just like so enamored by the gum. <laughs> well played, Debs. Well played. Alright, so yeah, sadly we're gonna have to go back over here some prepares and stuffs like I could maybe mm, I was about to say I could maybe like grab some fungal growth like kind of like I did before just by that rock but we'll, we'll just head back this way and that zipline can't come soon enough <laughs> I'm already thinking of like how I can like start building like upward on my base to make like a tower of sorts. Have like a, a zip line or something like coming off of it. Go away, little firefly. Fireflies are so precious. They can just glow right here, thank you very much. Mosquitoes, not so much. Go away, mosquito. I was like, what is this here? I couldn't tell what it was for a second. It's like a leaf. <laughs> Just like looked different from up top. <laughs> We've got a couple things to like scan too. So that'll be nice. Time to make something to eat. Oh, unicorn. I hope you have some good noms, friend. been anywhere in forever like uh four years yeah uh need this trip to air your brain out i hope it'll be a really nice trip mila you definitely deserve it friend also hey cam nice to see you how are you um dodging pokemon scarlet and violet spoilers uh with some reliable grounded gameplay i'm really glad that you're here friend yeah i um for me like i i'm like still on the fence as to like whether i'll like play um pokemon scarlet and violet um, but, like, I definitely do want to, like, see some gameplay from people beforehand, but, uh, I, I figured, <laughs> uh, it, you know, 
we played something else today like Grounded, it might be a, a good reprieve for anybody uh, like yourself who's like looking to uh, avoid some of that gameplay today. Oh, Unicorn, you've been playing some, uh, some Alpha Sapphire. Oh, that's a throwback. I hope that you've been having fun with it. It said black ant eggs are something that can only be used for omelets. Interesting. Don't know if they can be used for brat burst. Hmm. I don't remember like seeing any like in the black ant hill at all. So I wonder like where you would even find them. But yeah, either way, um, we're just gonna grab our red ant armor and go in there, hopefully find some more ant eggs just to be safe. And I'm, I'm definitely going to grab the other materials that I need for those brought first uh, beforehand to make sure that they don't explode on us. Yeah, the ant eggs, if you don't like craft anything with them in time, they will hatch and the ants will be very angry. Also, hey zombie, nice to see you. How are you? I hope that you're having a good day. You think that uh, Pokemon is the only reason you'd actually uh, think about getting a Switch? For me, the big one is um, Breath of the Wild. Like, I'm really excited for Breath of the Wild too. And then also like Animal Crossing. Like that, that was the reason that like I got my first Switch. Um, it was like about a, a year before um, Animal Crossing. New Horizons came out uh, when they first announced it and I didn't have a switch at that time and I was like okay time to get a switch <laughs> but it would surprise me if like the next generation of Animal Crossing also came out on switch I almost feel like at that point we'll probably have another console oh I didn't mean to put away my uh, clover and sprigs gosh darn it let's grab those back out Oh, and I meant to grab more sprigs too uh, for the the uh, armor dummy. Now oh, I'm the dummy. <laughs> All right, uh, we'll go here and we'll scan. Let's scan this first. The mushroom chunk. We can now uh, make mushroom slurry in another way. I was about to say we we already know how to make it, um, just with different ingredients. Brain power level eleven. Oh, and it would have taught us how to make antlion ponchos and wide brims and spurs and the great sword, but we already know how to make those, so let's have to see what's at level 12 eventually. Then for pollen, what can we do with that? The shinobi sneeze. Let's see uh, what the deal is with the shinobi sneeze. Mm, would it be in here? Yeah, it's counted as a device. A pollen puff blast, a puffin, oh, a pollen puff blast hides you from enemy sights for a short duration. Interesting. <laughs> I wonder what else uh, pollen is used for, or if it's like just the shinobi sneeze. Used for one other thing, but we don't know what that other thing is quite yet. Okay, um, what else can I put away? We'll put some things in here. Um, some things in there too. I guess I'll go ahead and like repair this sword. Let's also put some web fiber on there and some curved rope. And hmm, where do I want to like put the ball in? Um, maybe I'll just put it somewhere in here for now. We do have a blood sack, so I can maybe make a um, a heal bossa now. Yeah, I can make a heal bossa. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and do that. That'll be good for healing. And some of these things can go in our food chest over this way. Let's do that. Thought it was gonna put everything away. Never mind. If it honeydew, we'll keep that on us, um, I think. I don't know, maybe we'll put that in there. 
And then these mushrooms, those can go right there. And the spoiled meat. I guess we could make that into like a spoiled meat slurry. Yeah, let's just do that. Might as well put it to use. Okie dokie. I feel like I should probably start making some like mushroom slurry. Um, because if we decide to make anything in the future with like mushroom bricks, I'm going to need these. So yeah, maybe we'll like start doing those too. Okay, all right. Speaking of mushrooms, I've got like one growing right here in my house. <laughs> so I guess we could like chop this soon. All right, um, sort that. And then we'll go up here. We'll grab our ant armor. Put it away like a silly billy. Then what else is it that we're going to need for the additional uh, bra burst? Fungal growth. Uh, oh, and dry grass chunks. Okay, that's easy enough. Cool. Okay, so um, yeah, we'll sleep and I guess we'll go to the ant hill and try to get some more of those in the morning. Can't sleep until like almost 1 a.m. Really? Okay, all right, well, we'll just chill here for a little bit. <laughs> oh, Unicorn, was Alpha Sapphire your first Pokemon game? Precious. My first one was either Emerald or Leaf Green. I can never remember which one. I know I got them around the same time. Still not time yet. Let me go get some water while we're waiting. So we are uh, kind of thirsty. When I should have like gotten like some aphids or something. Oh, so so we are uh, getting hungry too. Um, I'll probably just like cook like a tadpole in the morning. Forget that we have a bunch of those like around our base. Still not quite there. <laughs> just got home after driving for five hours. My goodness, zombie! Did you have to like drive that long for like work or? Never played a Zelda game. Uh, Breath of the Wild was my first Zelda game, so I definitely got in uh, later into the game too, that's for sure. All right, so down we go, and I think I am gonna grab like some tadpoles because um, we are like pretty hungry right now. Just need to be careful not to <laughs> drop in right where like Trudy 2 is. That's the only like scary thing about this face. Like, Sometimes she swims like right underneath it and like you don't really know like until you're like in the water, which is terrifying. Okay, all right, good. Oh, but uh, I've already goofed. Um, I didn't bring like an underwater like weapon with me. I could maybe hit them like with my shovel. Which seems like a, a, a bit cruel, but I think it might work. Got little tadpoles. We got two just hanging out right here. I'm so sorry. You were so precious. He's like, what did you do to my brother? <laughs> oh no, he running. <laughs> He's like, I gotta get out of here. I gotta go. <laughs> I'm so sorry. They just had the cute little bug eyes. Can I? Can I? Can I here we go. <laughs> I need some kind of like ladder um, coming out of the water, but sadly, I don't think you can like build like in the water itself. Okay. Um, Edpuls. Thank you for your sacrifice, even if it was not sensual. We'll take all those slurries and let's do those and we'll do those too. Yeah. All right, so slurries. We've got a bunch of these now. Cool. Um, all right, that's better. So we'll just chill out until we can grab these and then we will be heading toward, oh, I'm glad I remembered before we left. I need my gas mask. 
which is almost dead. Uh, so can I repair this? Thank goodness we can. All right. That would have been bad if we uh, if we left without that, because I was about to say I'm going to be heading toward the haze so that we can get some, um, some uh, whatchamacallit, uh, fungal growth. I was going to like scan for something, but like we can kind of find it like everywhere there, so yeah. All right, we'll go ahead and eat one of the tadpoles. Oh, it's pretty good. <laughs> and um, we'll get some At slurps. Least it's clean. Ish. And then uh, we'll be on our way. Did I pin anywhere over there? Okay, uh, we're just kind of going in this general direction. Alrighty. How far are we? 800 centimeters. I didn't think it was that far away. I definitely need to see about like making like some zip lines or something. So like if I have zip lines like going off of like my house, I feel like on top of the lantern would be like a good place to like put some some anchors for some zip lines and just have them like going off in like different directions. But just like the problem is like how how to get like on top of lantern. I would I would have to do some uh some big building for that, I feel. And I just did a lot of building for that base. <laughs> so it's just like I'm kind of building out at this point. Building out? Is that a word? It is now. I think you might be able to get in on Switch as well. Oh, are we talking about like the original Zelda or are we talking about um, Pokemon? Sorry, hey, I got lost. No one likes a nosy neighbor. I do. I like the Weevils. I still need to get like a Weevil pet. So the Weevils um, like Mushroom Slurry. So like I could have brought one with me. Do I even have like a like a pet like house yet? I don't think I do. We definitely need to set up for like a little companion soon. And I did enable no pet death in the game as a, an option. And I was really glad to see that that was a thing. Because it's fine like if our character does, but our pets, definitely not. They must live forever. Being of pets, I've got a, uh, a big puppy here. Hmm? Um, where is it? There's the puppy. Hey, Finn. What you doing, Finnegan? <laughs> you just resting? <laughs> He's a good boy. It's like listening out for his dad right now. Sun break. Oh, and there he goes. <laughs> Didn't have even turned on the cam. It's the tell him when he's gonna come back. Hang on, let me just turn it off. <laughs> so here's the thing. Um how much fungal growth I'll need will just kind of depend on how many Oh, I already see a larva over there. How much fungal growth I'll need will just kind of depend on how many um, of those um, ant eggs that I find. But like, I, I needed to get this first. Um, so like, you know, I, I don't know at this point how much fungal growth I'll need. So we'll just kind of get like a decent amount. So I think each uh, brought burst needs two. Uh, fungal growth? Yeah, it does. We just got two from that one. Ooh. Completely forgot with us getting closer to the haze. Let's put that on. I'd say if we can, like, find, like, at least, like, eight fungal growth, I, I think that would tie us over for some time. Like, a little bit. It's oh, like, I don't even really? know if we're gonna be able to find, um, like, four, uh, 
ant eggs in the in the ant hill. I want to say like back in like the the EA days, like a um, ant eggs like dropped like a lot more easily. Like you could find them a lot easier in the uh, in the ant hill. Just one over here. I was like, if it's a bunch of them, I cannot take them on. Or I don't want to, rather. Oh, oh, oh there's, much, there's a bunch. No, come on, no. Okay, all right, okay, that's enough. Oh, you weren't supposed to call in backup, okay? It was just you and me, buddy. It was just you and me. I thought that was uh, some graphite back there, so that's why I turned back. Gosh, I hate how, like, impossible it is to see through here. <laughs> oh, and a feather! Oh, I like that! But I don't like dealing with those dudes, so... Heck the feather. Is there actually a, um... Oh. Oh, there's a dude right here. Hang on. I can get you. Oh, there is some marble, like, right there. Oh, we'll have to, like, jump down and get that. Oh, 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 I didn't want you to fall off, dude. I, I liked it when it was just you and me. Oh, he's stunned. Ooh, Perry Master, level three. Nice. We'll get this uh, feather after all. Feels good, man. All right, and let's get this too. Okay, all right. Yeah, it says that there's a tooth nearby. I might go back down and get that one. Oh, or he's going to come up here. That works too. <laughs> Those things can jump, my goodness. <laughs> we just like paused, it was like mid jump. That was like hilarious and terrifying, like all at once. My health is not looking too good right now. Oh. All right, we have six fungal growth now. I would like to get a little more than that, but yeah, our just health is like not good at the moment. There's like one like alone right over here. Seemingly alone. Okay. Is that a Oh, it's a it's an ant on him. I mean, if he's going after him, I mean, maybe like the the ant will kill him. No, don't don't go after me. Don't go after me. Fight with the ant. Fight with the ants. Oh, we can get this guy. Oh, jeez. I was hoping that we could... Oh, I was hoping that we could uh, kill it before it exploded. Yeah, we are really not good on health right now, so... If we could get, like, one more, that would have been great. Because... I have seven right now. Which is uneven. And that's messing with my OCD. Yeah, maybe I will just um, take this. This will be enough for like three brought burst. We'll take these um, over to the ant hill, see what we can find. And here's another thing too, like if I uh, do end up finding more ant eggs, uh, more than three, then like we are really close by here. So we can just like come back. But I'm glad that we got like some beforehand, so. They didn't go hatching on us. Mac and cheese acquired. Oh, unicorn. So mac and cheese sounds lovely right now. I hope that you enjoy it. I like a little bit of kick. I like a little bit of Better spice to my, uh, to my mac. A vegan mac. When I was reading about the ant eggs, it said that they will spawn more if a lot of ants are killed? Really, Rochelle? Interesting. Hmm. I had no idea. What do we have lurking around out here? 
Well, I haven't been killing a whole lot of ants recently, Hello, so I don't know how many eggs we're going to find down here, but let's see. I wonder why that is. They're like, oh, we got to like respawn. I mean, I guess, so I guess that makes, makes sense. They're like, we got to like, uh, regrow our, our population size <laughs> since we've been killed off so much. I think my molar uh, scanner is broken over there. It's been like blinking for a hot minute. Such a maintenance. Got some more cookie bits. <laughs> I steal them every time I'm here. <laughs> um, okay. Hey, Aunt. What's the news? We'll go up this way. Yeah, it had to do with hey, increasing Aunt. their numbers What's again. The like, from, like, a realistic perspective. Like, it, you know, it kind of makes sense. They also, like, I, you know, I didn't want to hey, get in a fight Aunt. with the ants. What's the news? I wonder if it, like, matters, like, killing, like, the, the worker ants, like, the small ones or the soldier ants. Or if, like, they would, like... Um, drop more eggs either way. Scrabble along, comrade. I think I think technically when like a an egg hatches, I think it turns into a soldier. time I found two. If I'd find like one more, that would be awesome. stink bug might be a, like right above us right now <laughs> so we are kind of like right in that area <laughs> it's here heard an aphid just die all right we got two. That's something. So let's uh go home along. and we'll craft those. That was an interesting noise. I was gonna say we'll go home and craft those. Like I do have like a work table like right here that we could go to just so we don't have to go all the way back. I've just got like so much in my inventory right now. Like, I didn't really want to go to the upper yard, like, with all of this, you know? I mean, we are going to get rid of a couple things for, um, for, like, a lean-to. So we might be okay. Potentially. All right, well, I'm definitely going to need some dry grass, so let's get some of that. Just like chop down one of these. Should I need exactly? Uh, we would need eight totals. I need one more. There we go. All right, let's uh go to that work table. See about crafting these bums. Go ahead and eat uh, this too. Throw these back on. That is surprisingly not terrible. Also, zombie, thank you for the hydration. Much appreciated. 
<laughs> Carol, welcome in. Don't call the ants on me. Carol, I thought you were on my side, friend. What the heck? Uh, little Weevil, are you okay? I think he's stuck. Can I, like, push him out of the rock? Don't think I can. <laughs> Sorry, Weevil. <laughs> We're stuck. And I think we do have a roasting spit over here. We do. <laughs> okay, alright. You can go on there, and you can go on there, and then we'll go here, and we are gonna go to the Brot Burst and craft a couple of those. Okay, alright. So now we have a couple bombs are getting dark too but it's not quite dark enough to sleep we do have stuff for a lean too so like we could sleep over there um uh, if we need to Ooh. if you make if you make him respawn he won't be stuck how could i make him respawn also hey sloth welcome in how are you i hope that you're having a nice day all right, so we are now going to go over here, which is only 500 centimeters away. Yeah, I'm glad that we didn't go back home. I know we've got like a bunch of stuff on us right now, but I'm excited for adventure. Uh, oh, what I did, I gotcha. I, uh, I I thought like you were saying there was like another way to like have him respawn. I'm like, oh, is there like something in like the um like uh because i think there is something like um game repair cancel yeah you can like cancel nearby blueprints and recover your backpack uh through the game repair options i was like oh is there a way like to uh like repair the the stuffed critters too <laughs> There's some big ants coming after us. Heck off. Spider up here? I think it's just another big ant. Leave us alone, please. I really hope that uh <laughs> my uh scabby molar for the um the scabby scanner for the molar will fix itself soon. Oh, there's a cookie over here. Oh, there we go. Now it's saying that there's a cookie nearby. Yeah! I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna take these cookies from y'all. You are not gonna be pleased with me. There were like some like in the cookie. Oh my gosh, look at how many ants there are. <laughs> a lot of it is just rotten food, sadly. Fresh cookie sandwich bits. Nice. They're like, quickly, get it. <laughs> get it before she does. <laughs> I think they actually did eat some of it. I probably, like, don't even need, like, all of this, like, stuff on me. Especially since, like, I'm trying to, um, conserve space. Maybe a little, like... Y'all like rotten food? Oh, I can analyze the, uh, fresh cookie bits, too. Um, yeah, I feel like I don't need all of this rotten food. So, like, what can you make with the rotten food, even? It doesn't look like anything, which is interesting. Okay, I'm gonna drop um, all of that. All right, have fun, dudes. <laughs> is there a tooth in here? There's a slurpy slurp. You see that blade of grass? I think that's a spider. Hey, um, what's the news? But yeah, it does say there, there is a tooth nearby. I'm trying to figure out like where that is. Not like on top of here, is it? I think so. Yeah, we're like closest to the signal, like right here. So that almost makes me think it's gotta be like underground, like underneath there. Hmm, okay, all right. Uh, Spaceman, welcome in, how's it going? You've had a foundation buried in the log since you first built your base. Excited to get rid of that, right? 
I, uh, it's, it's a wonderful game, but sometimes, uh, things can get, like, stuck under the map and stuff, uh, which is not very fun. So, yeah, I'm really glad that they have that, like, deep hook option. <laughs> I just wish that they kind of had, like, something like it for the arrows. Because I've had, like, several situations where I lose my arrows because those get stuck under the map. And to my knowledge, there's nothing that you can do about that, sadly. Oh, fertilizer for the garden. Gotcha. Also, hi, Moonchild. Welcome in. How are you? Audio Junkie, welcome in too. And uh, hey, Adam, all the friendios coming in. I hope that you guys are having a really nice Friday. So glad to see you. All right. Up we go. Drop this. Ooh, and we did it. Almost got crushed by a boulder, but that's besides the point. And now we can more easily climb this way. And then up here. Get your science here. Welcome to the upper yard, my friends. Taking a look around. Keep the new one. We've already seen a sickly roly poly before, but that's the first regular roly poly that we've seen. And uh, we're greeted with a spider already. Oh, don't you love it? All right, um, we need to go over toward the charcoal grill um, because we need some ever charcoal chunks. Oh, that's a mouthful. Um, so yeah, and our antline armor that we got, that we were able to make, help us a lot so that we don't uh, burn to death, thank goodness. Do I still have on that uh, particular mutation? Yeah, fresh defense, cool. Fresh defense will help us so we don't uh, sizzle as easily either. Okie dokie. Um, so, you know what? I probably should have set up like a lean to like over by that, um, by that uh, ascent. I guess I could like put it over here. Yeah, maybe we'll just like set it up like right here. Okay, all right. So, lean to this way, like, if we need to sleep, we can do so here. If we die, uh, we'll respawn back here. Awesome. All right, so, ever char coal chunks is what we're looking for. Keep coming across uh, some enemies around here, too. Speaking of enemies, I hear you. I don't see you. I don't like that. Oh, right there. Is he stuck? Oh, that might actually work out in my favor. Oh, he was stuck. Where'd you go? He was right here. Gosh darn it. Here you Ooh, that actually did more damage on him than I thought. I'm surprised. Wow, okay. Um, I thought that was gonna take a lot more hits. We got tough gunk, my friends. I know a lot of stuff is starting to request uh, tough gunk. I'm sizzling. Girl, calm down. We found the uh, charcoal hot springs over here. Oh, jeez. Oh. I liked it better when that other one was stuck. Oh, we got two. Come on. Oh. You. It's just so nice when they just like stand there. It's like, yes, I can deal with this. I need to look at their info too. Like see what they're weak to, but honestly, we it seems like we've been doing pretty well with the uh, crossbow. All right, <laughs> I'm going to look at their data entry, but uh, before we do, let's uh, go chill out here in the uh, hot springs. So the nice thing about this hot springs is like it actually like heals you very slowly, but it, it heals you nonetheless. This might be a nice place for my uh, for my lean to <laughs> just put it right in the water. <laughs> OK, uh, so for the ladybird larva that we just found, yeah, they're weak to stabbing and um, arrows from your crossbow do count as stabbing, so that makes sense. Also fresh, just don't use chopping or hammer on them. Spicy or slashing, cool. Okay, thank you for dropping that hype in chat for Eve. Much appreciated. 
Um, hope to continue. Have a good day, everybody. Thank you for the cozy vibe. Soli, definitely make sure that you get some good downtime, friend. You deserve it. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. It was really good to see you. I hope you have a great uh, weekend, too, if we don't see you before then. Okay. All right. So, like, I'm, I'm kind of just tempted to, like, go and sleep. Um, that'll regen our health, like, a lot faster. It's just, like, so slow here. Let me, like, also do, like, a, a fiber bandage. Like, that would definitely help me. All right. Here are uh, the charcoal chunks over here. So we're going to try to find these. This is what we're looking for. A body sizzling. Oh, oh. All right, running back. Actually didn't sizzle like quite as uh, quickly as I thought it was though. We got our first ever charcoal chunk, friends. Oh, so exciting. All right, let's uh, see about getting some more. Uh, they're like um, these chunks that are like right in front of the Layman bits. Oh, did we get two from there? Oh, I need to get out. I need to get out. Dang. Body's on fire. This is fine. <laughs> totally fine. <laughs> also, Adam, thanks so much for stopping in. It was good to see you, friend. And uh, Spaceman, thanks so much for the follow. Are there mantises in Grounded? Um, so I have not come across any mantises yet in my playthrough. However, um, upon the 1.0 release of the game, um, they did show a mantis like in one of the trailers. So it definitely seems like there there will be one that we come across at some point. But yeah, I, I have not seen one yet. Thanks for the chill stream, of course. Of course, I'm so glad to have you guys here. Things are not like super chill right now. They're quite toasty and spicy, in fact. Oh, if I could break that. <laughs> it's always a chill time with you guys. Another one. Another two right here. Feeling very toasty. We got three from that. Awesome. Whew. That was definitely toasty. <laughs> Just trying to make sure that we get all that we can. I'm seeing one more here. I, there's definitely another one up there, too. And uh, maybe some up there as well. Yeah. Ooh, run away, run away. <laughs> We're up to 12 chunks. Nice, nice. I'm trying to think, like, what all uh, we can even craft with the ever are cold right now. I know the oven. Really excited for that. Uh, but then something else that I don't know the recipe for quite yet. And even the oven itself only needs four. So yeah, we've already got enough to make like three ovens at this point. I'm still going to keep collecting. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, what the heck? You look around. Did you see that? Oh, oh god, that scared the bejesus out of me. What is that spite? Oh, oh, I don't like that. Oh, I don't like that at all. Do you see that spider over there? Oh, oh. It just like leaped like so far and was like glitching out. Oh, I don't like that. He's like blocking like a big like um golden molar too. That Oh! seconds. 
<laughs> oh gosh. He was doing some freaky stuff there. Wow. Yeah, I did not like that at all. Um, okay. <laughs> this is why I have yet to play this game. Um, it's a wonderful game. Minus that. <laughs> The good news is, um, like, you can, you can, um, turn on, like, arachnophobia, um, options in this game if you choose to do so. Um, but, like, there are still spiders and they'll still attack you. They'll just look like, like, big angry blobs instead. I did not like that guy. What do I need to repair my, uh, crossbow? Two silk rope. Ah, wish I had brought that with me. But I kind of intend on, like, after we get these charcoal t chunks, probably, like, going, like, back home. So that this we can, like, make unbearable. the oven and then make, like, some new weapons and stuff. And then come back this way. I thought we were dead again. Got like at least like three more uh, chunks up here. Are you kidding, dude? Go away! This is the no-no zone. Go, shoot. I do not like how he jumps. That is not, that is not cool. I'll be the <laughs> lady spider marshmallows. That is what they look like in the arachnophobia setting, that's for sure. Is there, there, is there anything like in here? Is that another chunk? That is. Oh. Okay, all right, I'm out. I'm very toasty. Ooh. I'm surprised that we're not, like, losing health, though. That was interesting. Because, yeah, we were sizzling for, like, a good bit there. Huh. Hey, did we get all of them in there? Hopefully so. It says that there's a molar nearby. wonder, like, where that is. It's like, oh, I see it. It's back there. Let's see if we can go grab that. Yeah, thankfully, it's pretty uh, cool back here. Molar, at least. I don't know if I'm ready to get that big golden milk molar where that spider was just yet. <laughs> Alright, uh, we do have a chunk right here that we'll get. Hey, there's another one right there it looks like too. Yes, but I know what they are. They can't fool me. I feel you. I feel you, Biscuit. That's, like, part of the reason that, like, I don't have that setting on myself. Like, I am absolutely, like, afraid of bugs, especially spiders. Like, if I see one in the house, I shriek and I call for Nick to come get it. Um, but, like, just, you know, even if I did have that setting on in this game, I, I feel like, kind of like what you were saying, I would still know that it's a spider. <laughs> I don't know if it would like help my my terror whatsoever. What time is it right now? Uh, it's a little past midnight, so like honestly, it would be a good time to sleep. And I think we have gotten all the chunks at this point. So the only thing is like I might want to get some more of the um, the ladybird oh. larva before we go back home. Because they dropped the tough gunk, and I want to say that we need a tough gunk for some things. But we got a lot of uh, the charcoal chunks there, so that was really good. 
All right, um, so let's go in here and yeah, we got 24 uh, charcoal chunks. Awesome. I currently only got three of the tough gunk. So tough gunk is, oh, it's used for that Sarah's charm thing. That would need 10 of it, but I haven't even found the right elf charm at this point. So I'm not super worried about that. It's also used for the mint mace and uh, the salt morning star. Yeah, um, each of those need 10 tough gunk. So I, I would really like to get some more of those uh, larva before we go. Let's eat that roast. Mm. I need this normally. And we'll put this back in our tool bar so we can get some slurpy slurps. That's not so bad. Okay. So let's see about those uh, larva. I almost wonder if the spider is like not over here right now or if it's sleeping. Because if it is, we might be able to get that uh that tooth. Well, there's a larva, which I needed, so that kind of works out. up to four tough gunk. Definitely uh, slow going with that. See if we can get uh, some more of those to pop out. What is an aphid doing here? My goodness. Aphid, you got some nerve. He's like, I don't care if it's spicy right now. <laughs> I'll be over here. Did I see something shiny just a second ago? It looked like there was, yeah, yeah, there is something buried there. Just like, do my eyes deceive me? I can't wait until they add, um, those extra full bar slots with the update. Yeah, right now I'm just like having to like switch back and forth quite a bit. Hot cha cha candy. Haven't used any of this quite yet, but uh, we will. It's like everything else in this game. <laughs> I don't know if there's anything over here. Oh, there is a mixer. Oh, well, at least I was about to say we'll put that on our map. I don't know if it'll actually count. Yeah, it does count as a landmark. Okay, all right. I'm definitely not going to activate it right now. <laughs> definitely not ready for that. Um, Let's like head upward a little bit and see if we can get some more ladybirds up there. But like, I don't want to go super far again. Like I've want to uh, head back soon and um, want to head back soon so that we can oh this was another chunk here oh man there's a skeleton though he was like crushed by this boulder what in the world I was not expecting to see this over here it's a dude he's crushed Hang on, hold up. I need to drop some things to pick it up. Uh, can I? What can I drop? <laughs> we'll drop you right now. Um, we'll, uh, drop that for now too. Um, <clears throat> we can drop that for now as well. And um, we'll drop um, those for now too. Okay, all right. Don't roll too far, please. <laughs> Just gonna get this stuff up here. We've got another one of those like ominent journals. Oh, maybe I didn't need to drop stuff. Recon journal. 
entomologist. So this is, I think, the second one of these that we found. The first one we found over near the hedge. I want to say it might be the same... Mm, I, would, I was about to say it might be the same member. No, I think his skeleton was in that cave. Expedition, expedition member JK. Uh, department, agricultural entomologist. Depart, or excuse me, date. Uh, September 27th, A27, 1989. So that's the way it'll be. We'll all split up and regroup. Never. Seems logical. Not. There's a reason so many insects thrive in colonies, working toward a singular goal, functioning as a unit. Uh, functioning as one organism, we would be surviving together, but instead we're going to die off one by one. Wasn't wrong. I'm certainly doing nothing of importance out here solo. So far, I've seen uh, a very strange coffee maker and avoided a gargantuan mulleted child stomping around the only place we called home. I'm going to make my way west, around the barbecue. Maybe I can rustle up some coal chunks and some bearing, and, and come bearing fire the next time I find one of uh, one of the others. Boiling. Ooh, that worked for the cavemen, right? Ooh, jeez, I did not realize that I was on fire right now. <laughs> Sorry, ma'am. At least she let me know. That's good. <laughs> So that is like maybe like at least the third time that I've heard mention of a coffee maker in this game. It's obviously important, but I have not come across it yet. So interesting. Hey Seth, nice to see you. How are you? I hope that you're having a good day. Welcome, welcome. You have an agreement with the spiders? I see, I, I have not come to any kind of agreement with them. They, they can be outside, I'll be inside. I, I That would be a great agreement. Got like a couple pictures there. And then what is this? The entomologist badge. Oh. Is that like, I thought I was gonna be like the, um. what does that do? I thought it was going to be like the um the assistant manager key card where like it would like not be in our inventory. It it's actually another one of those um what does it consider itself? Um it's a trinket basically. A badge from an ominent scientist granting access to their specific department of work. It gives you buffed attack and an imperfect block. Oh, I wish I could wear like all of these. Um, see, this one gives me invincible shielding. Imperfect block. Hmm. <laughs> I guess it's kind of fitting since like <laughs> he got crushed by a, a, a boulder. He couldn't block it, <laughs> which is kind of sad. Oh, interesting though. All right, well, um, Suspicious snapshot. We need to we need to look at those. I need my dandelion tuft too. Um <sighs> At least I would like to have my dandelion tuft. Um Inventory is so full right now. Painfully full. I really don't need weevil noses. Uh, we'll trash those. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's take that back. And let's see about those snapshots that we just found. Doing good. Just uh, relaxing. Glad to hear it, Seth. I uh, didn't have work today because they didn't need everyone um, just uh, scooping off. Oh, have you guys gotten a lot of snow there, Seth? Hope that you're staying warm. Would it be in data? Maybe in like stuff? Keys? Have we found all the keys? Interesting. Um. Boss notes. Places. Ominent. Here we go. So, so maybe we haven't found all this stuff. I was thinking it would show us like empty slots if we haven't um, found stuff yet. 
But like considering we found snapshot five and six, you know, it, it's gotta be like some before then you would think. A blurry photo of what appears to be a coffee maker with various wires coming out of it. This is the, the illustrious coffee maker that they keep mentioning. There's gotta be something good there. And like, I'm pretty sure that Wendell really liked coffee. I wonder like if we'll be able to like find him there. That would be interesting. So I don't really know what this is in front of the, the photo, but like, it looks like it's up on a pedestal, like the, the, the deck for like the shed. And then there was like a brick wall behind it too. I want to say it might be like a brick wall, like, like here. So maybe, maybe like this is the coffee maker. Ooh, interesting. Um, and then there was an, another photo too. Suspicious snapshot six. This photo shows what looks to be a scabby, but much larger, perhaps belonging to someone before they were shrunk. Hmm. Where is it? It almost looks like it's on like top of some books. So uh, I think there were like some books on top of the picnic table, but I don't know if I remember seeing like a big scabby um there. Interesting. I wonder like why um they took a photo of that. That was a cool find. I'm I'm glad that we found that. Glad that we came over this way. That uh ended up working out, right? Let's do another fiber bandage, and I'm gonna go up this way. We're gonna see this if we can find um, some more of those larvae. Ooh, speaking of larvae, hello. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. We're just like, keep going back, keep going back. <laughs> we, uh, did we get any tough gunk there? We did not get any tough gunk. That sucks. Okay, all right, well. Let's, uh, keep going, shall we? Another one. Look, it's stuck behind there. That actually might work out in my favor. Hey, this is going well. <laughs> oh, am I out of arrows? Oh no, I was out of stamina. I was like, no way. I was like, I thought I'd been doing pretty good about going and retrieving them. Oh, uh, acid glands. I've already got 20 of them. I, I, I feel like that's okay. Um, I don't know if I want to drop something else to like get more acid glands, you know? Oh, I got two inches of snow last night. I gotcha. I'm hoping that we'll get some uh, soon. But uh, according to the forecast, it looks like definitely not like this month. Possibly next month, I'm hoping. I'm crossing my fingies. With snow, like I, I'm the type of person, like I, I definitely don't like to go out and like drive in or anything like that. That causes me a lot of anxiety, but um, just like being able to like At stay inside and enjoy it from the indoors and like have those cozy feelings, maybe drink some vegan cocoa or some cider, read a book. I, I just find that like super cozy. I'm glad that we came up here. We're definitely finding a lot more uh, the larva. There's some raw signs up there, I think. Let's see if we can get on this leg. Oh, can I get on the leg though? Oh, there we go. I don't know how we did that. Look, that looked like really high up. And yeah, I know my uh, crossbow is damaged right now. Sadly, I'm not able to repair it at the moment um, because I didn't bring any silk rope with me. But we're gonna be going back home after we get uh, some tough gunk. I kind of wanted to get like 20 tough gunk so that we could have enough for like both weapons. But um, it's just like been a struggle to get the tough gunk from these things.
Ooh. Oh, there's a- the spider is up here. Are you kidding, dude? <gasps> oh, 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 no. Oh, I had him. Oh, did you see him? I think it was like a scarab. Ah, oh. did he just like dig underground? Spider, I blame that on you. I tried to, uh, to peep him. It just was not working out. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's uh, like a uh, charcoal bag here. And the spider is over there, heck him. <gasps> oh, but also, do you see what's in that rock sizzling? Something that I need to give myself even more inventory space for. Let's go ahead and just like eat that. Oh, We're not quite to 50%, but close enough. Hello. Flaming sword. Whoever shall pull this sword from the stone shall be worthy. Okay, we're, we weren't worthy. We're being attacked. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. No, it's a raid, are you kidding? I wasn't worthy. Is he trying to like kill the sword? Like what's happening? I thought he was gonna attack me. Oh, jeez. Okay. I don't I don't know what's happening right now. I did not think that Can I can I can I grab this? No. Well, that didn't go well. <laughs> oh, I did not think that that was going to trigger a fight. Oh, I hope I didn't blow it. I hope I can like still go back and get it. Oh, oh no. Mastering the secret. So it's, this, the raid is still happening. Oh gosh, I gotta run. But like the sword itself is like almost halfway damaged. I'm oh. Sizzling. Oh gosh. Oh no, it's gonna die. Yeah, no, it's going down. Not worthy of the flaming sword secrets. <laughs> oh man. That's kind of hilarious. Um, okay, so the thing about that flaming sword um, in the early access of this game, this flaming sword was there, but you literally could just grab it. I was not expecting that it was going to start up a fight. <laughs> that, that was kind of funny. I don't think there were any other ones like that in this game since the full release where like where it started up a fight like that and i think i've gotten some of the other weapons from out and about i think is it still there or did we lose it it is still there oh i want it <laughs> okay all right Oh, but wait, we would need to repair it? Like a raid? It doesn't look like we need to. But I know with the mixers, if you fail those, uh, you would need to repair. Jally, welcome in, by the way. I hope that you're great. That was crazy. I'm gonna save um, before we try to grab it again. Although, it looks like it did do like an auto save. Maybe like right before I tried to pull it last time too. So we can maybe just do that. Okay, well, I just saved again, but I'm curious, like, where um, this one was. I'm going to try to reload uh, that autosave. That way, like, my weapon and armor, like, won't be damaged. We'll see. Also, Sunny, welcome in. Thanks for the lurk. I really appreciate you. I hope that you're having a good day. Mm. So it was like right before we pulled that. We got like really lucky, I think. Okay, all right, stepping away so we're not sizzling. Oh, Seth, I hope so too, friends. What, uh, is it hockey? 
We're gonna try this again. <laughs> so hot. You know what I was thinking that we uh, never mind. Um, what I was thinking that we could potentially do is like set up like some barricades like around like the sword. But like it didn't seem like the larvae were coming in like that fast. But I mean, then again, like where are they gonna come from too? All right, stepping back so I don't sizzle. I think we're under attack. All right, where are they coming from? I see one coming from over there. Okay, get them. Don't you jump up there. No, no, no. Focus on me. Yep, come over here. Good larva. Right? Who else? Sharpshooter. Hey. Oh, goodness. That was a big leap. Oh, two. Oh, no. Let me try to kill the one in the back first. Okay. All right. Pull. Okay. At least we're getting like some tough gunk here. Like that's actually helpful. Oh no, oh no, they're attacking it. Oh, get away, get away. Go, go, shoo, get off. Oh no, oh, they're gonna kill it. Oh, oh, oh no, oh, it's gonna go down. Oh my gosh, there are just so many of them right now. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I like when I go up to it, it just says no. <laughs> like, you've lost your chance. <laughs> but we know it would give us another chance because... Oh, man. Gosh darn it, I was gonna kill you. Okay, so it will let us go again at it now. get all my uh, arrows back. Are some of them stuck in here? Uh, at least a couple of them are. Big sad. Got 27 arrows on us, which is not a whole lot. I wonder, can I like build in here? Because if I could like put up like some walls, like that might be beneficial to me. Uh, but sadly, it's it's not going to let me. I really want that sword. <laughs> oh, um, but we might have to come back with a, a better weapon. But again, you know that helped us uh, with the tough gunk. I think <laughs> a little bit. We've got six now. I'm kind of just like tempted to like keep um, like starting this up just so that we can like get some more tough gunk. Then they like all spawn here, which is like really nice. Mm. Oh, you can repair it during the, the battle as well. Like if I had a repair tool, ooh, that's good to know. Yeah, I think I'm gonna like go at it again just for the sake of getting tough gunk. I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to like actually get the sword right now. Just for the sake of like getting some materi materials, I think this would be like a, a decent place to kind of like grind for them. Well, there were some up here too. There's a fight starting here. <laughs> you don't say. All right, they usually like will spawn from over here first. Yeah. Don't you jump up there? Don't you do it? No, no. This is not your zone. Come on. Okay. Are we actually like even getting any uh, tough gunk from them? I know that one that we just killed, we did not get any tough gunk from it, sadly. Oh. Oh, oh so many. Oh, so many. Oh my goodness. Okay, all right. Well, that didn't go well. <laughs> Maybe we should just like farm them like solo. <laughs> I was about to say, surprisingly, it hadn't lost uh, 
any health there of a sword, but yeah, now it's going down. This heat is unbearable. I'll go back up here and see if we can find any uh any more larvas just kind of like chilling on their own. Oh, I don't like that spider that's just like hanging out right there. I mean, I guess I could go back in here like right now while like there still might be some. But yeah. Oh, and my arrows. Yeah, I really want to get those back too if I can. They are just like killing that sword in there. I pass by the to get in. I don't think I did. Is it back this way? Not worthy of the flaming sword. One day. But yeah, I think that's like a hilarious addition that they added in. Ah, <laughs> oh, that one's like stuck underneath too. Gosh darn it. Alright, well we got back some of them. Over here too, it looks like. Alright, I have... 28, 29, 30 of my arrows. I think we originally came with like 39, so we got some of them back. Luckily, they're like pretty like cheap to make. All right, let's uh, go up here if we can. See what's up here, if anything. If I can get up here. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Was a little naggly. Anything on top of the bag? I'm kind of surprised that there's not like raw science. Never mind. <laughs> I stand corrected. <laughs> oh, oh. Ooh, almost completely fell off. I wasn't like expecting that like ledge on the lantern. Maybe I should put on my dandelion tuff just to be safe. If I still have it. Yeah, I do. Oh, there we go. Big jump. Scientists make this look harder than it is. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm going to put back on our. I was about to say I'll put back on our lucky charm. Actually, let's jump down first, and then we'll put back on our lucky charm. See if we can find some more tough gunk. Again, I wanted 20, but like it's just like taking forever to get it. So if we can at least get like 10. I might be happy with that, possibly. We'll see how like our crossbow is looking at that point because right now it is not looking too pretty. Uh, is it Urk? Am I saying your name right? Welcome and thanks for the follow. And uh, Swell Badger, I'm sorry that I missed the follow earlier too. Thank you, thank you. I hope that you're having a good day. Uh, one hockey game, 11 basketball games. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Holy moly, Seth. Um, 20, 25 teams. Oh, if they all win, 173. Well, I'm hoping for the best. Remember uh, your old pal Wade, uh, if if you win them all. Just saying. <laughs> Irk like Lurk. Yes, Irk, it's nice to meet you. I hope you're having a good one. We are looking for some more um, of the larva right now. I was about to say, I hear one. I don't- oh, there you are. I was like, I don't see one. Never mind. I hate, like, the, like, inability to block, um, with holding the crossbow. Like, that's, like, one, like, big, like, downside to it. I thought I had been, like, able to, like, hold it up before, though. Um... And, like, block somehow, but, like, now it doesn't seem to be letting me do that. Scary boy. I thought I'd been able to, but maybe not. Yeah, we can with that, but just not with a crossbow at all. Which, again, you know, like, makes sense, but... We're up to seven tough gunk. Whew. Getting there. <laughs> Getting there. Slowly but surely. Oh, and look at that view of the uh, of the shed up there. Oh my goodness! Oh, 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 oh! Almost uh, had too good of a view of the uh, shed. <laughs> Wasn't watching where I was going. I'd rather not fall in the hole right now. Thank you, game. I hadn't intended on going this far before. You know, we went back home to like repair uh, our stuff and like make some things, but. 
still looking for those, uh, those blasted larvae. I don't know if I can find them, like, this far back. Look at these uh, mushrooms here. I wonder what I would get from these. I don't- they might just be like the other mushrooms, just like scorched. Because they kind of look scorched. Timber! Yeah, it says just like mushroom chunk, so it might be just be like the ones that I found before. Um... Let me just drop that for now and see. Yeah, it's just the regular mushroom chunk, so I'm not bothered by that. Alright, I'm gonna take back my feather. It's interesting when I dropped it too, it suddenly like wasn't scorched anymore. <laughs> see a hot cha cha is over there. And a glove with some raw science. Abandoned gardening glove. Raw. It's okay, little gardening glove. I wouldn't have abandoned you. You're precious. Well, we got like some pipes over here too. Ooh, that is like a straight shot for that pipe too. I'm very tempted by that, but also again, like I don't. Inventory space. I think I do see some raw science in there. Keeping makes me feel a little creepy. And a tooth? Oh, 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 oh! I forgot that I didn't put back on my dandelion. I was like, why is this not working? <laughs> well, um, so much for that pipe. <laughs> we'll just get that later. I didn't, I didn't really want that pipe anyway. Cuba. Oh, but I need a tier three ax for it. Spider. Like that. All right, let's uh try to find our way out of here. <laughs> Emphasis on try. Oh, there's some salt clusters too. I want them. I'm probably just gonna drop the feather. I hate to do it, but. I hate that it's like getting like so dark now too. Um, where are we right now? I don't know if I can go up this way. Yeah, this looks like a dead end. Nothing over here? Let me get out my torch, too. Light. Burn back the shadows and turn away the inky depths of the night. Another tooth? I think that's maybe where I came from. Possibly. Got like some, uh, what do you call these, like jacks here? Oh, I hear a ladybird, but I don't see a ladybird. Oh, I was about to say, but the ladybird sees me. Come here, my pretty. Come here, my pretty. Oh, was it a scarab? Gosh darn it. She saw it, but I didn't see it. Yeah, the scarabs are actually kind of pretty. I thought she was talking to the larva, and I'm like, I don't think they're very pretty. <laughs> I have no idea where it went. All right. Um, go this way. This might bring us back up, possibly. Oh, oh, jeez, scared the bejesus out of me. Here. Dust mites, okay. Well, I would like to kill y'all too, but um, again, don't have any inventory space, so. Oh, health is very low right now. Can I get one? How did I pick that up? Dust Mite Fuzz. Thought I didn't have an inventory slot. Hey, well, we got Dust Mite Fuzz, so we can scan that too. Just getting all the things over here. Got some mint caps. 
Okay, all right, I'm leaving. I can see I'm not welcome. This might be another dead end. Goodness gracious, so many dead ends down here. I don't know how we're still alive. Oh, okay, all right. Back to the ascent over here. My goodness. How much tough gunk do we have? Seven. Still wanted three more. <laughs> Oh, big spider. Oh, gosh, scary. Not enough backpack slots. Oh, it's because I'm equipping the torch right now. That's why. Um, Nothing else I really want to drop. Like, I guess I could, like, drop the larva spikes. Because I do have, like, a bunch of those. I don't need this many. That's a lot of larva spikes. <laughs> okay. Um maybe we'll go like back toward oh, are we hungry right now? Wonderful. I do have um like cookie sandwich bits that I could eat. Just trying to save those. But might have to eat some. I have limits. I guess I was hoping that would uh, regen some of our that's not so bad too. Looks like it might be a little bit, or maybe that's just my fiber bandage. Probably the fiber bandage. All right, well, let's uh, go back over this way. Maybe we'll have some ladybirds um, that have like respawned back in over here. Just heard like the footsteps and I'm like, who is that? Oh wait, I'm me. Girl, calm down. You are good. It's funny, sometimes like Willow will be standing like like right beside a charcoal for like a solid minute and doesn't say a word. But then like you just like step like just barely into it and she's like, oh no, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Might be a little bit of some drama. I kind of want to sleep since it's like so dark, but um yeah since i don't have a whole lot of food i'm i'm hesitant to do that all right can we get any ladybird larva to pop out i know i killed a bunch of them over here but i was hoping we could find some more hmm I feel like on the other side of that bag? I think that's starting to get into like some grassy area though. Which I kind of intend to go back some that way anyway. So that'll kind of like put us out right beside the the ponds. We could probably just like dandelion down uh, to our base. Very nice. Oh, big spider. Oh. Oh gosh darn it. Oh. Is that a lar uh, ladybird larva too? Of course we finally found one again. We actually like get away from it. I'm surprised. Well, I wanted to get away from the spider, but not the ladybird larva. There we go. Thank you for coming back out. Thank you for rejoining us. We did get another tough gunk there. All right, two more guys, two more. Oh, I mean, technically I need a lot more, but at least for one weapon, I'll need two more. That I definitely would like to have. I've got to decide which one I want to make to the uh, Salt and Morning Star, or um, taking a look around. One found. Black Ox Beetle. That's the first one that we've seen in this game or this playthrough. That's where I dropped those earlier. Um, 
I guess I'll just like look to see what like some of the enemies around here are weak to and kind of decide from there like what would be the better weapon for me to make. I think our options would be like Mint Mace or Salt Morning Star. That little aphid there. <laughs> He's like, am I safe now? <laughs> Sadly, we didn't get any tough gun from that one. Goodness. And I thought the ant lions were bad about like dropping pincers. Goodness gracious. I heard one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hello. Hello, um, sir. I'm not quite ready for you. Oh. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Ah! <laughs> okay. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. I'm just looking for some ladybug. Lady, I don't even know what I'm looking for anymore. <laughs> Where did he go? Where did he go? That sounds terrifying. Oh, <gasps> he was in the rock. I just get around here peacefully. Oh! Is he like stuck? I don't think he's stuck. I was gonna say if he's stuck, it's, it could maybe work out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh no, I shouldn't have tried it. I shouldn't have tried it. Oh no, oh no! <laughs> I was like, maybe he won't move, and that just ended up not being the case. <laughs> what time is it? Let's sleep. Uh, sleep sounds lovely right now. Oh, gosh. As scary as the rest of the bugs are in this game, like, Upper Yard just, like, amplifies it, like, times a hundred. Oh, there's uh, something that we can maybe dig up over here. I'm also about to drink my last I mean, this uh, is probably what water. Of water is. Oh, so I guess we can have our shovel take that spot. I'm really excited to do um, some analyzing at a field station. Ooh, hello, chest. Um, something buried in the sand that doesn't want to kill me. <laughs> I know, isn't it nice? The treasure is just the icing on the cake. Oh, an omelette, mint shards, sunken bones, and spicy shard. Like so random. I don't have room to like take any of it. <laughs> um. So yeah, we might just have to leave this here and and come back for it. Okay. This is about to, to die, too. So I'm gonna have to, like, switch to another weapon, which isn't gonna be as good. Just hanging on to it for as long as I can. Alright, we will go back up and see if we can find a couple more ladybirds, because I just need two more gunk. Hoping that they'll drop it for me. No spiders, please. Hopefully the spiders will be asleep at this point. Any ladybird larva around here? I just need a couple gunk to make your presence known. Hmm. Not this. I think I might be able to. Miss last words. Oh, surprisingly. That was close, though. Oh, Ladybird, hello. Problem is with us being like, oh, a two of them? Ooh. Oh, man. I was about to say, with us being on this, like, kind of little ledge here. Oh, well, this might be the time to, uh. Oh, goodness. Switch to sword since my thing is about to die anyway. Oh, stunned. Oh. 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 
Oh no, oh no. Run. Ah, uh, it I was about to say at least we got picked up that one, but we didn't even get a larva spike from it, which is really unfortunate. Gosh darn it. They're being just like so stingy on the gunk. My goodness. I'm determined to get 10. <laughs> and then we'll go back. How's my armor doing right now? It's, uh, some of it is less than halfway. Thankfully, I think I still do have some antlion parts back home. Thankfully, none of them need, uh, pincers. Otherwise, this heat is unbearable. I would have to go and farm some of those too, and... I'm already struggling enough with this. Oh, hello. I've been looking for you. Thank you for popping up. Oh, come on. Almost there. Almost there. Dunk? Of course not. I wonder what else can drop the tough gunk. Or if it's like just these guys. There's gotta be like something out there that like um, has a higher drop rate than these. I heard a ladybird there for a second. Where'd you go, ladybird? If I see like digging around, it'll pop up somewhere. Problem is, I just don't see any digging around. <sighs> um. Well, we know that there is like still one over where we like hopped where we died. Yeah, and I still see it over there too. E oh, Our air is back too. with the gunk <laughs> it's going to be the death of me goodness gracious I felt like we were you know like even though it was like pretty slow before already like I felt like you know we were still getting it you know at least like every three larva right like we haven't gotten like any recently my goodness Ladybird? Oh, yeah, Ladybird. Hello. Like, even though it obviously, like, takes more hits with the sword for the Ladybirds, like, I'm, I'm kind of liking it better than the crossbow, honestly. So at least with that, we can block. Dunk. Oh, we did get a gunk there. Oh, just one more. Just one more. Oh, please, please, please. Eat some mushrooms too. How do we uh found these? Good thing I'm hungry. I was about to say I can't fit them in my inventory, but luckily we can just like consume them uh, without grabbing them. There's a field station up here. Oh. Let's uh let's go to it. I need to scan like so many things. I was just going to do it back home, but this works too. That hot cha cha's candy. Can't like get in this box or anything, can you? Mm, it doesn't look like it, but I guess this kind of tells you where all the hot cha cha's came from. <sighs> Up we go. And. I think it's right down there. Is there anything like at the end of this handle or anything? 
Do I have on my dandelion? I don't. Let's go ahead and put that on just, just to be safe. Oh, look, guys. Let's see what we can find. Darn mosquitoes. The bane of my existence. Look at uh, those, like, holes in the wood. Oh, a new one. and the termites. That one popped up, but, like, the exact second that we looked, that was convenient. <laughs> so we just uh, scanned a termite soldier. There's uh, probably the other type of termite then. Typically there's, like, a soldier and then, like, a worker. Um, okay. So going back to some, um early access talk for those of you that like didn't play this game um in that time the this section of the upper yard was here including the shed um and like this pedestal in front of it however i don't think this bush um this potted plant whatever you want to call it i don't think that this was on the uh on the the deck of the shed before interesting apparently we're near some raw science is it like right underneath us or like where is it i like even hear it i just don't see it must have been like right underneath us or something over there oh made it to another field station surprise oh i was about to say that i'm not seeing any like cassettes or anything Let's see what this is about all of these eyes. The eyes. They are always watching. The backyard is watching. Strange noises, stranger occurrences, coincidences. Oh, I think not. Or is it my mind playing tricks on me? I, I, I feel the senility at the edges of my thoughts. I have grown so old. Uh, just the other day, I found my tape recorder laying out that I knew I had put away. Ooh. I would not have been so careless, and yet there it was. Could it have been Burkle? No. No, 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 no. Such a conspiracy would be beyond this capabilities. Something darker is afoot. Ominent, perhaps. I knew it might be too great a risk to liberate that equipment from them. Whatever it is, it is always watching. Ominent. Surely. But how could they know? I took such precautions, and yet... Burgle, execute end-of-day procedures. Wait. Ignore that. I will see to it myself. It sounds like he's even, like, starting to, like, mistrust to Burgle. Find a new venue for my research. Away from all these eyes. Time for me to find a new venue away from all these eyes. So what's the venue? Where did he go? I, I you know, we've got to be getting closer and closer though. Um, and yeah, like, you know, there was reference like even at the beginning of the game where he was like, um, I think I'm being watched type deal. And at that point you're kind of like, okay, is he like just paranoid? But um, at this point we know that like, there were ominous agents, like, in the yard as well. So they definitely were watching him. So we can scan three things currently, and we have five things to scan. My goodness. Um, let's scan... Oh, no, excuse me. I, we have four things. I just have two groups of the Evercold chunks. We'll definitely scan this first, since it's a rare one. Science! And we can now make an Everchart torch and canteen. Ooh, very nice. Look at all of those points that we got from that. Oh, that was great. Cool. Um, let's do the tough gunk too. Termite axe. That is the tier three axe. Oh, I'm excited. And then we'll also scan this uh, dustmite fuzz here too. We'll have to scan the cookie bits later, but that's okay. Fluffy pupa hat. We did see some pupa earlier, but I couldn't um, collect it, I think, until we had the tier 3 axe. So, so yeah, With in terms of termites, um, it's kind of one of those things where, like, I, I kind of, like, want to kill some of them now. 
um, so that we can go home and craft the axe and that kind of stuff. But I also don't feel well prepared in terms of um, weapons. What did it say uh, on the data for that that uh, termite soldier we found? They're weak to stabbing and salty. Ladybirds are weak to fresh, which would be like mint. But it really seems like we're going into like some termite territory. So I feel like it would maybe be a better option for me to make the salt morning star first. Eventually I'd like to make them both. And yeah, with the black ox beetle, they're also weak to salty. So I, I feel like that just kind of confirms my uh, feeling that we should maybe do that one first. Um, ooh, gum nuggets. I don't know if I have five of those. So you might have to get some, some more gum nuggets. All right. Still need that, um, one tough gunk. I think in the next update that they're putting out, like the 1.1 update. <gasps> Scarab. Oh, got a oh, new one oh, here. Oh, um. Oh, oh, that's not what I meant to have. Oh man, I thought I like. Oh, I was about to say I thought I pulled out my um, my my uh, what you call it? Crossbow. I couldn't because my inventory is so full. Oh, we'll get that scarab one day.